Good morning, good afternoon, and good evening, everyone. I have a Xiaomi Redmi Note 9. The set is updated from MIUI 12 to MIUI 12.5.1. Yes, my set is updated to 12.5.1 in Write 11. Now, request is if we want to downgrade from MIUI 12.5.1 to the last release of MIUI 12. Will this be possible or not? Yes, I will show today in today's video how to down downgrade your Xiaomi mobile phone that is Redmi Note 9 from MIUI 12.5 or 12.5.1 to back to the MIUI 12. If you are new on my channel, you didn't subscribe my channel yet, then it will not cost you any penny just click or tap the red color subscribe button and also click or tap the youtube bell icon stay connected with me whenever i upload new video you will get notification immediately thank you so much for doing that you must unlock the bootloader of your xiaomi mobile phone if you want to flash custom recovery if you want to update by manually flashing it or if you want to downgrade your mobile phone always always before doing flashing save all your internal storage data this uh, flashing will format everything check the battery should be charged to maximum and then go to settings then go to password and security turn off the lock screen password then go back to settings and if you are using me account sync your me account once and then remove your me account then same way go to account sync sync your google account once and then remove just not to get any id verification issues after flashing when you if you have done all these things you can simply power off your mobile phone moving towards my computer screen i have already downloaded the miui global image uh, rom file fast boot rom file version is 12.0.8 and also download the mi flash 2017 this particular version both file links are provided in my video description so you can download it easily after downloading the rom file extract the rom file in this folder after when extracting done then uh, over double click the extracted folder you will see one more folder inside double click on it and you will see bunch of flashing files now come back and copy this particular folder this particular folder from here and paste it to the computer main hard drive partition C D or F I will go to my F partition click on it and the you can you will see like the PC name, this PC and the main hard drive partition. Paste that folder on this main hard drive partition. I already paste that folder. And double click the newly copied folder and you will see all the flashing bunch of files. Now come back to the downloaded folder and extract me flash 2017. Now let me inform you that if you have already installed this Mi Flash 2017 on your computer hard drive, then there is no need to reinstall it. Or in case if you are not having this Mi Flash, then you need to install this. After extracting the Mi Flash, double click the extracted folder, you will find the Mi Flash installation file. Double click this file and this file will start installing on your Windows 10 or maybe whatever Windows you are using. Now after when installation done, then come to the desktop for, and you will see the Mi Flash icon. Double click the Mi Flash uh, fl icon, click yes on next window and Mi Flash software will get open. Now click on select, then go to that main hard drive partition. I will click on F partition and uh, here we go, you will see your particular folder that is going to be flash click on it you must see all the folder like ap bp bp in etc etc when you click on here then click ok and the me flash is now ready to flash the rom file on mobile phone come back to the mobile phone now we need to boot the mobile phone into fast boot mode and uh, for that your set must be power off now hold the mobile phone in your left hand and press and hold the volume down key 
connect the cable other side of this cable must be connected with computer press and hold the volume down key connect the cable and set will be booted into fast boot mode soon and then immediately leave release the volume down key when set got booted into fast boot mode my set is booted into fast boot mode and also connected with my computer now click on refresh here the me flash will detect the phone here we go you will see numbers on device and progress bar this means that me flash detected the phone now come down here in case if you want to flash the stock rom and you want to relock the bootloader then leave this selection clean and lock clean all and lock so what will happen after flashing the stock rom the mobile phone bootloader will also get relock and those who want to flash custom recovery after flashing the MIUI 12 rom and want to uh, bootloader remain unlock then for those come here and select clean all like uh, just like me i do not want to relock my uh, set bootloader so i will select clean all and the bootloader will remain unlocked i can flash custom recovery i can root my set later because bootloader will be remain unlocked if you want to root your set or you want to flash custom rom come here and click on flash the flashing will get start it will take time maybe around 10 to 12 minutes do not open any video file do not plug in usb device in your computer because flashing is not supposed to be interrupt just wait let the flashing complete then we will continue and when the flashing got completed you will see success here and flash done and the set will start booting it will get reboot it will start booting to stock rom you can disconnect the cable from mobile phone and the set will start booting back to stock rom the first boot will take a time so you have to wait for it and we are done from computer you can turn off your computer now Finally first boot complete and you can see the MIUI 12 back on Redmi Note 9 before it was MIUI 12.5. I will complete my setup screen. Now I will go to settings and then we'll go to about phone and this time you will see my set redmi note 9 is downgraded from 12.5.1 back to 12.0.8 stable rom android 10 and one more thing here tap on all specification and scroll down you must see the numbers below base band this one which means that flashing went perfectly on your mobile phone xiaomi device set is downgraded properly and will be working absolutely perfectly this is how to downgrade the redmi note 9 or xiaomi device from any particular version to back to the any particular version if you got helped by this video do not forget to give a like do share with others subscribe my channel thank you for doing that take a good care of yourself we'll see you in my next video till then Goodbye.